That's alright, I'll show you how. You need to let it catch the breeze. If you hold this, now give it a running start. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. How am I supposed to control this thing? I'm moving all over the place. I just poked myself. Whoa! <laughs> I didn't mean to run into Hoshi. I was I was watching the kite. Are you okay? Yes, Shoji, but uh, could you get off of me? This doesn't look right at all. I'm so sorry. Let me help you up. <laughs> da -da -da. Aha! What? You realize what just happened? I fell on top of you and I was borderline inappropriate? That's how we met, remember? I mean, you didn't end up on top of me the first time. <laughs> <laughs> Wording! Whoa! You ran into me, quite literally. That's true. I didn't even think about it. I was too distracted by the fact that I was crushing you. Okay. I'm not delicate or anything. I need to pay better attention. Not your fault. No harm done. Mary should have taken over for fl kite flying at first. Hope I didn't hurt the kite either. I'm sure it's fine. I'm really durable and I've crashed it before when I was first learning. Come on, let's go get it. And then maybe we can play tennis instead. I think we've drawn a little too much attention to ourselves with that fiasco. Goddamn. When did they let those goddamn lesbians out of that high school? Uh, high school's up to no good! This went week by so fast, OG. I'd still like to brush up on some more studying before we go back to school. I've done less than I usually do. I understand. I should do the same. I haven't actually been alone over the break, so I've had things to do. But I don't want to let that get in the way of my grades. Do you want to listen to some music while we study? That sounds like a great idea to make it less tedious. As long as I don't get too distracted. What kind of music do you listen to? Uh, the girl stuff? The, 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 the hip hop? Hoppity hip, hip hop, hippy, hippy to the hip hip hop, and don't stop to rock to the bang bang boogie. Um, something to the beat. Uh, uh, call, uh, I personally am a big fan of classical music. Uh, Holst, Gustav Holst. Uh, I usually listen to pop music. Uh, you study? Okay, I can put some on. I mean, I, uh, really, I just said the first thing that came to mind. Most girls listen to boy bands, right? I'm here. I think this is a recent playlist. Machine might, must not listen to very much pop either. Shit. We're both secretly men. I just got M. Night Shyamalama ding donged. It's a little hard to focus with all this noise. Some of the lyrics are so explicit. I don't even know what some of it means, but I can tell it's dirty. I really haven't listened to this kind of music in a long time. I wonder if it makes Hoshi uncomfortable. Ugh, I'm never going to learn anything at this rate. Just kidding, uh, classical is probably... Hey, tomorrow's probably going to be spent packing and traveling, so I thought maybe you want to go out last time. You can make a day of it! Sounds like a great idea. We can both masquerade as women. A few places in mind for us to go if you want to start getting ready. Alright, I'll do that. I'll wear some casual clothes since it will... I won't be able to dress like this as much once the school starts. Shoji, can I get your help? I, uh, I, I, uh, why, what, what, what? Why are you walking in here like that so casually? Can't get my bra to latch. I think the metal latch is bent oddly, so I can't connect it. Can you do it for me? I, uh, um, gotta, gotta help each other out, right? At least you came here with some clothes on. <laughs> Thankfully. Just turn around, I appreciate it. I hope it's not broken too badly. I like this bra. So do I, but I didn't expect to be seeing it. I really hope my face isn't red. There, I invent the latch too, so it shouldn't give you as much trouble putting it on. Thank you, Shoji. Are you almost ready? Yes, almost. Just a second. Mm, just to go put on some clothes now. All right, I'll finish getting ready. Why is she even wearing that outfit? Isn't that more for, like, evening activities? Or strip clubs? Or maybe she is a stripper. Who is also a man masquerading as a woman. And we're secretly inside a soap opera. Ah, uh, okay. I hope she isn't planning on going to a bar tonight. And even if she was, why would it matter what she wore under it? Unless... Oh no, I hope her night before school doesn't involve other guys. It's one thing, acting like a girl around girls. But around guys? What if Hoshi goes out with someone? That shouldn't bother me, but... Ugh. This could be a real mess. Same clothes, I guess. Alright, whatever. I'm ready, Shoji. Take your time, though. The library isn't too far from here. Oh. 
Why the fuck would you dress like that going to the library? Holy, are you gonna do some freaky shit in the back of the library or something? Maybe in the supply closet, where you're supposed to knock first. Now that we're back at school, everything seems normal again. Uh, university, or uni for short, is fast approaching and I know I have to make myself stand out in the application process. Selene is helping me with that too for being a raging lesbian. Really puts good remarks on your resume. Track meetings are going really well and our team got a lot of recognition lately. Oh, oh, that's, that's how. Gotcha. With Oshi, I managed to balance a new social life and keep my grades high. The only thing that's really deviated from my expectations about boarding school is the uniform I'd be wearing and being a woman. I'm almost looking forward to uni because I'm certain I've distinguished myself. Interesting exams are daunting, but aside from that, I can finally be a guy again. Well, that's not completely true. Sometimes I wonder what will happen to Hoshi and Selena. They're both bound to do great. I just wish we could stick together. Most kids get friendships that last a few years, but I've only had mine for a few months. But yeah, yeah, life isn't fair and all that. I shouldn't mind. Really, I should just be grateful that I made it this long and my cover hasn't been blown. Hmm? Oh no, I've lost track of time! Hey, no-show. Are you coming down for practice or what? Don't tell me you're getting lazy now. We just had a break! No, I'm coming. I got distracted from time and time got away from me. That's all. That wall you were staring at must have been awfully interesting. It was! They're more interesting than you being thirsty as fuck. I was studying! Mm-hmm. We really went to practice today, anyways. It was raining hard earlier. Of course! Every day we don't practice could be a day our competition does. Do does. Can't fall behind over a little rain. Good point. Awesome. So let's go. Alright, I'll take this lane. I showed you you take the outer lane. It doesn't matter which lane I get. Well, you get the inner lane, it's technically shorter, but you also have to take sharper turns. Which makes some people run slower. Uh, anyway, get set, go. Maybe Selena's right about not falling behind in the competition. She and I are almost evenly matched now. She always gets a second win near the finish line, but eventually I think I can catch her. The track is so muddy today, though. Why is the track? Mu if it's a track, okay. If it's a running track, it should be like paved with that like. Uh, spongy like rubber style stuff that's almost like gravel tar cement stuff that they use for uh driveways like the red the, the red the black stuff it should be like that you're trying to mm, trying to suction to my shoes not far to the finish line now though it hasn't slowed me down much far oops uh ow what happened sorry shoji yeah like see there you go it should be like that kind of spongy stuff i feet slip right out from under me so did mine. Why were you running on the grass? She pushed me right into the mud. Are you okay? I, I think so. Ouch. I'm a little muddy. What's the matter? Oh, I skipped that one. My ankle. Ah. Can't stand on it. You goddamn thirsty bitch. You broke my ankle. Look what your antics have done. It hurts every time I put pressure on it. And this mud really isn't helping me balance. Oh no, tell me you didn't really hurt your ankle. You're joking with me, right? Whoa, no shit, it's all your goddamn fault! I'm really not. I think I slipped weird and twisted it. Plus, I'm covered in mud. A pig would... I'm so covered in mud, a pig would be jealous. I'm even sticking to my hair now. Well, I, I guess you are, technically. Oh, that's not coming out easily. Oh no, this is really bad. Come on, try to stand up slowly. Put your arm around my shoulder. Once we get into the shower, we can get this mud off and see how hard it is. I, uh, I, uh, 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 uh commence stammer. Sh shower? I oh, know, I've got to find a way out of this. Well, I th actually, I think it's all right. <laughs> Maybe all right isn't the best word, but I just want to point out what is going on with her shirt there. Let's just look at it. Exactly. Really, it's not a big deal. Let me help you and don't be so stubborn. You're not exactly in a position to refuse help unless you want to crawl back to school. No, I think I'll crawl back. I... At least most of the other girls seem to have left by the time we got here. What am I going to do about Selena? Hopefully she'll leave me to stand alone in the shower. We're both muddy. <sighs> Fucking Selena. The thir Why did I have to deal with a thirsty, thirsty lesbian? I'm trying to masquerade as a woman. And it is no. It is not working. I'll turn the water on. Just stay out of the spray for now. Oh, it seems a little cold when you first get in. No. 
need you getting a cold on top of a hurt ankle. Things like this can't be helped, I guess. But I do feel guilty. You're goddamn right you should feel guilty! You didn't do anything. Bullshit! She pushed me down. How do I not know she was the one who made me twist my ankle in the first place? I guess this isn't so bad if we both keep our clothes on, I guess. That would be a lot worse. Alright, I think the water's warmed up now. Does that feel okay? Yes, it feels fine. I can help you out with your hair if you want. Here. How did you manage to even get it in your ear? I have many talents. One of the which is masquerading as a different gender. Clearly. Hopefully running is still one of them and the team can't afford the team can't afford to lose you. Now I would feel really awful if we got this far and you had ended up having to sit out for the rest of the year. Well you should feel awful then. You should feel terrible. You should go commit Sudoku. Even if this happens, I I can develop cheerleading as one of my talents. Don't worry about me. Besides, I don't think it's that bad. If you're optimistic, that's good. As I slip and fall in the shower because it's excruciating pain. Optimism is one of the first steps to recovery. Now I'm soaked, but at least most of the mud is off. Ugh, wet clothes are the worst. She's right. Move the water, the fabric of my shirt is sticking to my skin. So is hers. Wouldn't it be such a bad thing if the shirts weren't white? I'll just look somewhere else. I don't think our clothes are going to get clean like this, so we might as well just strip them off. I, uh, I, uh, I, uh, I, uh, I, uh, I, uh, commence stammer. What? No! Is there anything I can get out of this? What do I do? Uh, admit the truth. Uh, oh, uh, oh! Uh, uh, save! Uh, 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 I, uh, say nothing. Uh, I can't blow my cover. I'm deep undercover. I'll be killed. Good old cement shoes, like good old mafia style if they found out. Well, Shoji, I don't know what to do. I'm like a deer caught in headlights. Why does she look a little sad? Maybe she's feeling guilty because I hurt my ankle. But she's not responsible for it. No! She's... <laughs> she looks sad because she's thirsty as fuck and she's not gonna get to see me, supposedly a girl, uh, naked because she's a thirsty lesbian and wants some of my cross-dressing body. Uh, I don't feel bad. Yeah, it's, sorry, let's just... I think I can stand up on my own. I can just face away from her. Maybe I can keep my dick from hanging in between my legs. Oh, are you self-conscious? Uh, alright. I'll just stay over here. Be careful and hold on to the wall. My heart's pounding so loud I can barely hear the water from the shatter. If I move even the slightest wrong way, it's not even just about me. Selena's probably naked now, too. And you be quick! The faster I finish, the faster I can get out of here! Ah! Shoji. Ah! So sorry, I didn't mean to look. I'm sorry, I should go. Wait, no, I should ask if you're alright. She saw, and, and I saw her. It was only for a second, but can't believe I slipped! How did he put pressure down on my hurt ankle? I think I the shower floor with everything on display. Real freaking discreet. I, I'm not hurt. I'm definitely not alright. At least she didn't notice. She's not looking at me, but I screamed. There's no way she didn't notice. Okay, if you're sure, I'm going to grab my clothes and wait outside the shower for you, okay? Just shout if you need something. Oh, okay. I don't get it. That should be furious with me. I've been lay lying to her this whole time. I was even in the shower with her while she was naked. I thought she'd strangle me. I really don't understand this. Maybe she ran to tell the teacher. Or just put my clothes back on and get out of here quickly. My wet clothes? Telling it will only make it worse. Most of the mud went down the drain, along with my dignity. Hey, all finished? How's your ankle? Do you need any help? It's feeling a little better. I still have the same clothes on! Or at least I'm too bewildered and concerned to care about that right now. I'm sorry, I should probably explain what happened in there. I've actually known for a time, since you got here, really. That long? Come on, you, were, you weren't in a skirt or anything when we first met, so I had a really strong suspicious anyway. But you always called yourself a girl, so I figured you identified as one, even if you weren't born one. I was hoping you would start trusting me enough to tell me that maybe you were waiting for the right moment. Oh. Well, that's, well, not entirely right. No, I'm not actually, uh, cross-gender or wishing to be calling myself her. I'm just actually cross-dressing, you know. I'm actually a boy. I only pretended to be a girl so I can get into the school. Yeah. Really? You wanted to come here that badly? This isn't one of those perverted things, is it? <laughs> I thought so! No. Really, I just... It was actually just one big mistake. I couldn't undo it easily, so I just pretended. So I don't identify as a girl, but I kind of had to impersonate being one. Really? Hmm, what a weird situation. Did you think I was being genuine too when I said you'd look cute dressed as more girly? Almost a shame. But even if you got the reason wrong, 
I still knew you were male in one sense or the other. Wait, so it still doesn't change your opinion? So you're just, you're just thirsty as fuck for anyone that you can lay your hands and grope on.